Hi everyone, it's Tiffany. I'm back in The Sims 4 with our Ranching to Riches Challenge. I'm so excited because the last time at the very end of the episode, we basically turned ourselves into um, a, a rich family here. We've got 4,929 Napoleons. I did get some some comments from you guys in the last video. Someone said that there's somebody in town that will sell your nectar for double the price. So I don't know if I don't I don't know who that is, where that is. We'll find out. But for now, we're gonna stick to the plan, and we'll see. Also, I was told I should do more of the the variety, so like potatoes and where what else was there. Uh, strawberries, potatoes and strawberries. Oh, I guess and lemon. We don't have lemon. I wonder, I wonder what's the highest, highest dollar amount. I know the grape, the grape nectar was a pretty penny. So I'd assume the strawberry nectar is also, but anyway, we got the strawberry, we've got the grape, we've got the apple. So the lemon and the potato, I kind of want to experiment with them. Maybe just get one of each and just see if that's something we want to dabble with, right? So I'll kind of put them back here. Also, they might not be in season. We might need to build like a little greenhouse or something. We'll, we'll find out. All right, let's plant those. We'll also get planter boxes at some point. <sighs> we gotta clean that out. Dislikes gardening. She's wanted to dislike gardening twice now. I think she's just in a, unfortunately, she's just in a bad mood. Uh, rightfully so. I don't think we have, yeah, we're too uncomfortable to do any of that. Let me reevaluate. So it's Sunday at 6.30. We have plenty of money to be able to make ourselves comfortable, so maybe we should just go ahead and get the basics. Like what we need, we need. Let's just go kind of through the list here. Let's start with bathroom. Um, that, none of those are bathroom that I clicked. I think I'll just go ahead and, this is such a cute little area. I'm gonna make it the bathroom area here because we're gonna stick with what we have and we'll just add to it because I don't know if we're ready for walls yet. You know, we just got a tent. So like, we might not be ready for walls just yet. I'm gonna go ahead and put a shower right here. So that'll cover hygiene and bathroom. And then what else do we need? Food, we have the cooler. I mean, we really could go ahead and just get like a mini fridge or something that might be doable. I don't know why I can't figure out these categories, uh, but the mini fridge, they're, they're a nice solid, solid choice. Did we get, I don't think we got one with the the new pack. We got a bunch of kitchen uh, cabinets and, and stuff, but not a fridge, right? It doesn't look like it. I feel like we should have got a fridge with this. I guess not, okay. But the good news is like this kind of fridge would definitely go with, with the pack, but anyway. Um, that's 1,700, we can afford it. That's the good news, but I really don't want to. I don't know the difference. Let me see here. So the cooler, just functional off the grid. I don't know if it's if we should just stick to the cooler, or if we should really go and get a new, like a, a, a get a fridge, essentially. Uh, food quality three, power consumption two, reliability three, plus cooking skill. We could get that, the little toaster oven and a little, but the problem is if, if it rains, it's not gonna work. So maybe we should just avoid that for now. Uh, so that's that's hygiene, that's bladder. We don't have fun, but she does have reading wilderness digest. I think that's fun enough for now. <laughs> Social would be another thing, but we should really just invite people over more often. So let's let's just get ourselves a shower and I think we'll feel a lot better. So I'm gonna go ahead and have her do that. She is desolate from low social. It is almost seven, so we will go ahead and maybe call Meadow. Oh, chatty family call. That's a good one. So what do we want to do? Socialize. She's going to socialize right now. Encourage horses to breed. Oh, goodness. We're not quite ready for that. Um, chat. We'll chat with her. Social is so low. Maybe, maybe it is time since we're making the money. We've made one. I almost said 1,000. We've made 4,000 simoleons. Like, let's not get ahead of ourselves. But since we have, in fact, made money... Let's go and maybe introduce ourselves to some people. Hello, sir. Who are you? This is Don Gooseman. Let's do a friendly introduction to Don. Okay. He is, he's a free spirit. He's just going where he needs to go. What if we go here? 
and we just follow him. We could just follow him pretty easily. I mean, the problem is he might be, is he like going somewhere? Oh, okay. That answers that. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to have her travel. Let's go into like another town, go into town. Um, no, why did I click volunteer? Like, what am I doing today? Travel and travel. We'll just go ourselves. We're just going to go check out some of the town. Feel We feel comfortable enough to be able to do that. Let's see. So we currently live over here in, in Riders Glen. I don't, there's not really any place for us to go other than to other people's homes here. So we have, and also this place doesn't really have anything. There's a, a rental. We can go, go on vacation in our own world. But we have, that's cute actually. Anyway, we have the bar, we have the nightclub, and we have the park. I kind of want to go to the park. I feel like we could go to the bar and, and maybe like... Uh, what's the word I'm thinking of? Network. Network is like, oh, I sell nectar. <laughs> anyway, this park's more of like a hoist, a hoist, a hoist park, a horse park. Howdy there. Swing by the Hay Now Equestrian Center for the best training in town and test for your horsemanship and your competitions are open from 7 to 7 every day. So I guess that's this place. All right, so this is where we would bring our horse, I guess. Not the park I was imagining, if I'm if I'm gonna be quite honest here. So we have no horses here, um, no people as of yet, but I'm hoping we'll be able to see some soon. Oh, oh, is that somebody? There's somebody here. Hello, it's June. Let's do a friendly introduction. We really need we need some social so. Let's get this done. This is actually pretty cute. Uh, very interesting. It's like a almost like a rooftop bar kind of situation. I like it. Okay. I don't think she could socialize. I think she's broken. I'm going to have her come down here. We have, well, let's see. She is still a teen, by the way. That might be why people just don't like her. Uh, Cloud. Friendly introduction to Cloud, maybe? Okay, we're not. What are we doing? There we go. Finally, some people that will talk to us. Also, is there a computer somewhere? There was... No, that was chess. Maybe we should have gone... I don't think there's, like, a library, so... We are a little bit out of luck on that one, I think. Let's see. Anything? This is the little equestrian center, right? So we can enter our competitions and spectate horse training we obviously need a horse we could see a little horsey over here i wonder if we can go uh say hey to the horsey we could we could definitely do that uh who else there's somebody here who is this erica we have may prescott here what the heck what are, what are you guys all doing here i need some like new townies to interact with I mean, really, anybody should do because they're social solo. Hmm. All right, let's get out of here. Kind of want to go on and search for. Uh, actually, no. Okay, let's go travel by ourselves once again. I'm like ready to just ditch this idea of socialization. <laughs> just kidding. Rain is social. She's a social person. This town. Everybody may hate her, but she's gonna prove them all wrong. She's gonna she's gonna show them that she's she doesn't have anything wrong with her. Uh, so I guess we can go visit somebody in particular. How about the Gooseman family? She's gonna travel up here. She's gonna be like, "Excuse me, Mr. Gooseman. I heard a lot about you. I just wanna get a chat with you and and see what's up." Oh my gosh, he lives in the cutest little cottage. Hello, Mr. Gooseman. Funny introduction. Hi, sir. How's it going? Um, do we have anything? Slap him silly. How about ask about day? He did make food. We could just grab some food. <laughs> Let's see. Does he have anything uh, interesting? Interests. Interests? Share outdoorsy tips. <laughs> I'm living off grid and I don't know. 
Anyway, let me see if I can get into their house. Knock on door. Is this? This would be great. Sure. Let's let's talk to Meadow. All right. So he let us into his house. What a big mistake. He does in fact have an oven. What's more important, a computer or an oven? He does not have a computer, which makes sense. He's in the bath. Maybe we go ahead and we cook. We cook a, we're gonna bake a cake. We're gonna do this. Hopefully, hopefully it'll work out and he won't yell at us. This is inappropriate. What do you mean it's inappropriate? Okay, well, let's wait until he like leaves the room. Okay, he's sitting down. All right, let's resume the white cake. And then if he comes back in, we'll cancel the action. He knows what we're doing. Okay, he's gonna hate us after this. I'm making you a white cake. I never understood why we couldn't like cook in their kitchen. Uh, talk about warm temperature. Enough is enough, I'm gonna have, you, have to ask you to leave, but it's almost ready. No, no, come back, tell, tell a horse joke. Okay, wait, it might still be in there. Oh, I can't, I can't convert my cake. <laughs> I could buy a stove, it's not a big deal. All right, let's just go home. We did not make a good first impression on Mr. Gooseman. He actually does not like us. Um, that's okay, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. We're just trying to make a birthday cake for ourselves to celebrate our birthday, but like, hey, you know, if you're heartless, that's, that's fine. <laughs> I mean, I feel like anybody's house that I go, I mean, maybe not a stranger because I've never really, I mean, I guess everybody's gone over to a stranger's house at some point because, you know, you go over somebody's house for the first time at some point, you know what I mean? Like you have gone to your best friend's house as, as barely knowing each other before. Well, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. What I'm getting at is most people I know would probably let me use their kitchen to bake a cake. They would think more the more inappropriate thing would be taking a shower maybe, going to the bathroom maybe, but no, because I've, I've been allowed to do that too. Maybe I just know friendly people, I don't know. <laughs> All right, so bladder, let's go ahead and fertilize. And I think it's gonna be about time for us to maybe water and weed the garden. Um, and then grab a snack and then we'll get to make in our nectar for the day. No, we won't because we don't have any. Oh, she doesn't have enough skill for that. That's why. That's why. Okay. So we have to focus on grape and apple nectar and we don't have, do we have grapes yet? We have strawberries. I don't think we have enough skill to have the, or make the strawberries though. Um, and we haven't gotten any apples. We could just go ahead and purchase apples for fun. Let me see. There's no nectar in there that's aged hmm <laughs> i don't think we can make strawberry yeah we have to wait until we have more so i guess since that's the case let's maybe maybe uh plant a few more strawberry plants just so we have them for when we're ready to start making that strawberry wine let's go ahead and plant those she's actually in really good condition right now i kind of want to just get a small cooking device oh her sister's here that's actually great um let's tell a joke about a horse of course um let's see small talk get to know i actually think if we made oh, let's make a cake let's have a little sister birthday party that's what i want to do right now so we're gonna get a counter just just a simple counter i don't oh here i am just trying to pick a counter uh we'll get this one and we'll get, I don't know, do we need a fridge for, I don't think we need a fridge for this. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna go with this, this style. And I mean, I could have done this, this would have been fine, but let's go a little more rustic for now. I'm getting two counters. We're going big money spenders right now. All right, I'm going to have her bake a cake. Nope, that's canning. <laughs> We're going to bake a cake. Cook. And wait, what do we need? Fridge. I knew we needed a fridge. Just making sure we need a fridge for cake. Let me see. Yes. Okay, I figured as much. So let's grab a fridge. 
I almost would rather get the induction top than the, the oven. Well, I think to bake the cake, we need the actual oven. Uh, so let's just get a fridge. We'll get the, well, should we get this fridge? I want to get this fridge, the country kitchen fridge. Yes, I love it. Okay. I should get a different stove. Anyway, let's now make our cake for us, our sister and me, my sister and me, our sister. We're going to have a chocolate cake. Okay, sister, why are we lagging? Sister's gonna go into the tent. It's gonna be really fun. We're gonna have leftover cake. We have a whole kitchen here, but it's before it gets all broken by the rain, I'm gonna put it back in the inventory. I think this will just be fun for them to celebrate their birthdays together. Let's see. Brag about the ranch. You should totally, it's, it's great. Um, no, don't eat this, oh my gosh. Cake must be in the center of a table. Okay, let's do that. And then add birthday candles. Let's do this. Oh my gosh. All right, first, I think Rain was first born. So let's have her blow out the candles. Oh, is it her birthday? Nice. Um, we'll add birthday cam, cam <laughs> birthday cameras. Her sister looks a little upset back there. It's fine. Um, but we will have her add the birthday candles and we will have Meadow have her little birthday party too. Oop. Okay, let's see. Now, how do I do this again? Uh, age up Sim, Meadow. Are we having a birthday? Yay! Sisters! All right, what are we gonna reveal a big deep secret? I'm gonna actually put this in the fridge and we could eat it later maybe. I guess we should have gone ahead and eaten it though because we're kind of hungry, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and grab some cake and we'll go to sleep. And hopefully in the morning, hopefully in the morning, we can harvest some apples. Are they in season? They're out of season. That's why I knew it. Okay. So the strawberries, how do we, how do we, how, we're just gonna have to buy some apples and we're just gonna have to lose a little bit of money to begin with. And that's okay. You know, we're gonna, we're gonna get through it. All right. Let's make that apple nectar. And like I said, we don't, we don't earn it, earn what we think is fair for our hard work. That is okay. Okay, she purchased ingredients, we knew that. Let's just wait for her to, now she doesn't have to go to school. Lovely, lovely, I love it. Okay, she's awake, it is rebate day, so it's actually a really good day to, well we should put away our kitchen stuff. Let's go ahead and uh, make this nectar. Is she doing it? She's making it. I wonder if she's gonna fall this time. I wanna catch that on, on camera. Oh, there she goes. She fell. Oh my girl. Yeah, she did. She did. She fell on that one. That's okay. Stomp, stomp, stomp. It actually looks pretty nasty. It looks like oatmeal. I mean, hey, it is what it is, right? <laughs> this is interesting. Oh, oh, she fell again. Just all to make one bottle of apple nectar. This is actually, it's pretty complex. Like she fell three times. Okay, let's uh, get out of there. And what do we have? Let's, well, she can go to the bathroom, get something to eat. She's gonna have more cake, I guess, and use the bush. Ooh, I think our strawberry plants are ready. Well, harvest all. Okay, so she's got, what did she get from that? Did she get anything from it? Oh, there she goes. I forgot she needs to do that part. <laughs> Silly me. What a good day though. She had a birthday and now she's making nectar. Rain's dedication to rancher life pays off again. She knew just how to stop and extract an extra bottle's worth of nectar from this batch. Nice. So we got two bottles and they sell for 27. That's unaged. If we sold it as is unaged, that'd be two, four, six. Well, let's just round it to 30. Three, six, nine. It'd be 90 simoleons for one bottle and we pay, or what did we, um, what do we call, what does it cost? 
yeah, it costs uh, 40. So we're actually still making a profit as long as we sell it on the table. Let's uh, go ahead and clean the nectar maker. And I'm gonna just put those bottles right in here. We have three out of 13. I thought we had more than that in there, but that's okay. Okay, she's gardening skill level two. She's got 25 strawberries. So once we're able to make strawberry nectar, we're gonna have a ton. Where is her nectar? There it is, still level one, it's okay. Um, we're gonna go ahead and I guess we're just gonna keep purchasing our basic ingredients. Let's get four, how many, wait, is it three batches of three? Uh, let's just get this many. And uh, we'll go ahead and craft nectar. We'll do more of that. And then she is hungry, so we probably should go ahead and get a quick meal, some cereal. Uh, she does need, I want her to purchase something because it is rebate day and she does need to get a shower. Let's just go ahead and put some of this stuff away. I just don't want it to get damaged in the, in the, what do we call it? The rain. She can keep the counters though. I think they're fine. And then we'll see what else. I guess she needs to keep all of her bowls in her inventory. She doesn't need to. Oh, we can get the recycling machine thing, trash can. I wanted to get that from the beginning here. So let's just go ahead and get it. It's always an investment, but it always pays off. So we'll just go ahead and put that there. I still wish I could change the color of it. Now, let's see how much money we're going to make. Put that away. That's 10. So it's just going to be 10 per bowl, but that's okay. It works. That's fine by me. Uh, let's see what we can do here. We need to have some fun. So why don't we go read Wilderness Digest? And I'm thinking we go ahead and resume the apple nectar. And oh, I did purchase that on rebate day. That makes sense. So <laughs> I forgot for a second. And now we'll get a little bit of money back for them. All right, I'm just going to continue to throw these in the trash. I'm actually going to set some out so they're because this got this has to refresh and everything. All right, I'm going to actually, does she need to go to bed? No, it's, it's the middle of the day. I wonder, I wonder if she should, let's just keep her crafting the nectar. It'll be fine. I was going to say, I wonder if she should be getting another job. She might have another community job popping up. We can go check. Maybe we go check. Let me throw this away and then we will go look. All right, this way to the, the community board thing. Let's see here. We need a job. So she has, there's like no, there's no nectar one. It is all horse riding and mini goats and mini sheep. That's okay. Um, we'll just, just keep doing what we're doing here. Um, these are all going to be out of season, I'm pretty sure. So I guess we'll just go with like, instead of what I was saying, where we'd specialize in one specific fruit, I'm thinking maybe we just do what's in season, like an actual person should do. I just, I don't know, maybe down the line when we kind of need a break and we have enough money, we'll go ahead and specialize in just one kind, but we'll see. For now, we need to focus on making all the money. Let me go ahead and continue to throw all of these away. I think seven, it was like 14, so we would have made $140 so far, 140 simoleons. All right, we've got taxes. Um, we're starting to run low on money here. We're going to really need to do a little yard sale, but we do need to make sure our nectar is aged. That is when we are going to shine. So I'm going to go ahead and put that nectar in there. We got five out of 13, not too shabby. I'm going to continue to put these bowls away. She's going to harvest all of the prairie grass, at least some of the prairie grass. She also found a pineapple while harvesting prairie grass, which is pretty cool. I really want her to find some nectar. Sometimes she'll find nectar when harvesting it. We've got a dragon fruit randomly, which is really cool. That's actually really nice that we find random stuff while <laughs> harvesting this uh, this grass. I'm going to weed this, and we need to get rid of the insects. And then I think we'll, we can, well, we have enough apples to continue to uh, make more nectar. Let's harvest the prairie grass there. And then I think we'll go ahead and make another batch here. It's just, I wonder, I don't really know how much it is when it's aged. Do, do, do. I don't, I will just have to wait. Cause that was the grape that we had aged before and made 4,000 simoleons on. So we'll just have to wait and see. 
Now we do have this nice horse manure. I don't know how we apply it. I don't know if we just go ahead and no, come back. Clean the nectar maker. Make dir, ma clean the nectar maker. And I'm gonna see. I think you could maybe you drag it. Nope. I'm not. I really don't know. Maybe you need to be higher in the gardening skill. Not entirely sure. All right, let's go ahead and fast forward that. And Meadow is calling. She wants to go to the festival, but we do not have the time or the money for that. But I really did want to make some more money today. I just really, really dropped the ball on that one. Uh, did we do the, we did the bills. We do have, randomly have mail. I think that was from the birthday party. Let's go ahead and put that in there. Ooh, we got some starter flowers. We could open that seed packet and see what we've got. We got bluebells and holly. Liam, dad's calling. I've been thinking about getting to know as a friend. Uh, I have no idea who that is, so I don't know. But I'm going to say that's fine. Um, I think she's just relaxing right now. I'm going to have her go to the bathroom. And hopefully we can make whip up one more thing of nectar. Now we have 8 out of 13. I thought it would help 15. Maybe I'm mistaken. Did it not hold 15 before? I thought I did. Alright, so her hunger and hygiene's a little low. Yes, she's now nectar level making two. Wow, nectar making level two. Rain can now craft recipes for sensual strawberry nectar and potent potato nectar recipes using the maker. And she can now craft nectar faster, which is so great. Now we are good to go because we have enough strawberries to not have to obviously buy the, the ingredients that we need. We will of course use the rest of our apple though. I do wanna I do wanna use those. Uh dedicated. She got an extra bottle. Nice. We got two bottles of apple nectar. Alright, so I think I gotta throw this away. Nasty. Anything else I need to throw away? No, I think it's all. Uh, this one's outstanding horse manure. This one I think is just regular. Yeah. Now we do have six apples left, so that'll be six thingies of ap don't, ap <laughs> apple nectar. I cannot say nectar in the same sentence as every other word. All right, apple nectar. Uh, we'll make two more sets of that. Obviously not right this second. I'm glad we're really focusing on this right now and we'll be able to make some money, maybe actually build us a tiny little starter ranch cabin thing i'm not sure not sure how we're gonna lay everything out but i'm i'm excited let's see she just set her bowl there for me to recycle later that's fine that works all right let's get rid of that perfect look at that making money it's just a nice side thing because it costs a thousand and since we only have one sim in our family you know it's not we don't get a lot like if we had eight sims it would give us a lot more money back but that's okay we don't need that right now we have other things we need to focus on all right have a quick meal let's have some cereal and i think we'll jump right into crafting the nectar Ooh, yeah making a strawberry nectar let's make our last batch of apple and then we'll move forward and make a strawberry here we go and then I will put that in there. So nectar making before six. I mean, it seems like something we've got to do before the sun comes up because it'll get hot around here. I don't, I don't, oh. Hunter's spirit's fading away. Hunter's connection to the physical world is growing weaker with each passing day. <gasps> no, oh no, Hunter. All right, let's, um, did she finish the nectar? Oh, she did. Okay, cool. So we now have only a little bit of space left for our strawberry nectar. Oh. No, I guess we didn't make the apple nectar. Let's just go ahead and make a strawberry nectar. Likes gardening? Sure. I think that's safe to say. At least I want her to like gardening. All right, I'm trying to get the lag to go away. It's pretty It's pretty heavy right now. Okay, let's make this. I'm going to fill up this rack and go from there. She acquired her first bottle of strawberry nectar. We got additional information. So... The apple nectar that we have been making affects help sims feel inspired if nectar is at least 
lightly aged inspiration persists after nectar wears off. Aging. Leave nectar bottles unopened to let them age once a bottle reaches lightly aged. Positive effects are enhanced and negative effects are reduced. Nectar bottles gain maximum simoleon value when they reach finely aged. Nectar will age moderately faster if stored in a basement or cellar or significantly faster if stored in a nectar rack. Okay. Okay. So like if we let it sit in our inventory, it'll age, I guess. That's pretty cool. Uh, grape nectar. Let's see here. Do, do, do. It helps Sims feel confident. If it's lightly aged, a confident feeling persists after nectar wears off. Aging nectar bottles unopened. Gain maximum simoleon value when they reach finely aged. Nectar will age. I think this is all just the same. Uh, let's go. Prairie grass and nectar helps Sims feel happy and reduces tension. Surprisingly filling. If nectar is lightly aged, tension and hunger reduction is stronger. And then strawberry nectar helps feel, Sims feel flirty. If nectar is at least lightly aged, a flirty feeling persists after nectar wears off. Cool. I like it. Uh, it looks like this one. One of these plants wants to, wants to um, evolve evolve let's go ahead and do that strangely it's that one maybe because like oh maybe that was my first one i thought the front one was my first one for a second all right so we got our first bottle of craft nectar of strawberry i'm gonna go ahead and put it in the wine storage rack sorry the nectar storage rack all right that's 11 out of 13 so we can fit two more bottles not too bad, but I'm very excited. Once all of these are aged, it's gonna be great. Um, I wonder, let me, hold on one second. That was the last apple. Um, we're gonna clean this with vigor because we really should make sure it's cleaned. Craft nectar, we'll go ahead and do strawberry. I wanna open this up and just see what it's looking like. So we've got normal, oh wait, no. Slightly aged, or lightly aged, not aged, not, slightly aged not yet aged and then these probably aren't aged because they literally just made them in the last day sim day all right she's kind of kind of having um some problems here we got to get to the bathroom we've got to get a shower we've got to have some fun and all of that jazz all right, I also forgot, I didn't forget about her aspiration, but I definitely put it off to the side. Oh, are we full up on the, full up on that? We gotta get another one. But I forgot to focus on this. So it does say make 100,000 simoleons selling nectar, which we already sold nectar, so I'm not sure why the count's not going up. Select a bottle of nectar and select sell or drag here to the Sims inventory. Mm. The mysterious rancher who periodically appears around Chestnut Ridge is also willing to buy. So we want to find him, the mysterious rancher. So once we find him and maybe become friends with him, we'll be able to sell it to him. Um, it's not going to count for the market table, unfortunately. Lame. <laughs> the Let's see. The nectar price increases from not yet aged to lightly aged to moderately aged and finely aged. Nectar price increases from poor quality to normal quality and peaks at excellent quality or try using high quality ingredients. Nectars that require more nectar making skill to craft are worth more. Improve nectar making skill to craft more different nectars. The mysterious rancher will pay more money for nectar than selling it regularly. Okay. What else do we need to do? Make 50 excellent bottles of nectar and achieve level five. Okay, no problemo. She's a little hungry. So we'll go ahead and have a quick meal, have some cereal. Then maybe we'll read some Wilderness Digest before bed. Oh, it's only 11 a.m. <laughs> before bed. Uh, I really want to just take care of the plants, but they seem to be doing just fine right now. So I guess we'll do some prairie grass. We'll harvest all of the prairie grass. Those three, will they'll get done in a clump, and then we'll harvest this one. And then we want to grab, we'll probably want to buy another one of these racks. I forget how much it was, but we're definitely going to need another one. Because that one filled up quite quickly. <laughs> I would, and eventually we'll have a cellar and, and all of that stuff. So we found some cool things. Let's go into this 
buying catalog and get another storage rack that actually stacks, which is lovely. All right. And I will, how much was it? Well, we only have 11 simoleons left, so. I'll go ahead and start filling it with our nectar. So neither of these are aged. I don't have an organization system for these yet. Okay, I'm gonna sell this frog and I'm going to sell this. Now I, since we are waiting for all of this stuff to sell, I think it's safe for me to just go ahead and have her start a community job. We'll do the training the neighbor's horse just because you know she's done all she can do for now. Um, I think this is gonna be a place where I end the episode though, I had a really fun time. We really dove into the nectar making. Oh, unknown caller. Hang on. Uh, anyway, I want to thank you guys so very much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.